change the colors in your logo or graphics without Photoshop and without hiring a graphic designer, I have two tools to share with you today to help you do just that for free. This is a DIY trick, so let's dive into the DL. The first tool is a Google Chrome extension called Colorzilla. It's an eyedropper tool that allows you to choose a color from any page. The second is a website called Pixlr. Pixlr is an online graphic editor with Photoshop type features that you can use for free. Using the color dropper, I'm going to grab the color codes from the current Immensely Social logo and show you how I changed it from the old, more muted colors. Let's head over to my desktop. Head over to the Chrome Web Store and type in Colorzilla. And here it is. I already have it installed on my Chrome browser. It's this dropper right here. So we're going to head on over to the Immensely Social website. And right here is the new logo colors. Click the dropper and you'll choose this pick color from page. If you see a website or you see some colors that you want to get your colors from, you simply use this and hover over and it'll give you the color code for whatever color you want to work with. I'm going to choose this color right here. Click it and it's copied it to my clipboard. So then I simply head over to Pixlr. It's P-I-X-L-R dot com. Right here we're going to go to open an image from my computer. And I already have the old logo right here. So I'm going to select that. And then you can change your working space here if you want. And then all I'm going to do is this color block right here. I'm going to click it. And right here I am going to copy and paste that color code that we just got. Hit OK. And then I'm going to use this color bucket icon right here. And I am simply going to click all the areas in the circle of my logo that I want to change to that color. And that's how easy it is. I also want to change her shirt. Simply going to go back to the color that I want. And obviously you won't already have your logo done. I'm just using these. You can choose any color from any page that you want. I'm just using what I've already done here as an example. So I would click her shirt. It's going to copy the color to my clipboard. Head back over to our editor and I'm going to change this again. And you can choose colors from here too if you like. And I'm going to click Command V, copy and paste on my keyboard. And then I am going to, I still have this selected, and you can choose paintbrush, you can play around with all these different options, but this is the easiest way. And then I'm just going to click her shirt. And that's how easy it was for me to change all of my graph, social media graphics and web graphics for the Immensely Social logo. Play around with this, you can do a lot of stuff with this really easily. If you need some extra color inspiration, be sure to check out my color board over on Pinterest. There are a ton of color palettes there. I have the link for you down in the bio. Did you like this tutorial? Then be sure to give it a thumbs up and hit those share buttons below and share it with a friend. This has been Lori Hill with EmensleySocial.com. See you next time. I've been sick and running a fever, so I recorded this video with business on the top and pajama pants still on the bottom. That's how bad I wanted you to have this tutorial, so I hope you like it. See you next time. Ciao.